saying in heaven, Now is come salvation, and the strength, and the kingdom of our God, and the power of his Christ, for the accuser of our brothers is cast down, which accused them before our God day and night, and they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony, and they loved not their lives to the death. Amen. The last days are upon us. Disasters are getting worse. And this evil regime oppresses house churches more and more. This is the darkest moment before dawn. These are portents of the Lord's coming. Amen. Many brothers and sisters have been arrested and sentenced in our county. In such a tense situation, we're all a little afraid and weak. But we believe in the Lord's promise. His day is nearly come. Amen. Amen. We must pray in earnest. Hold fast till the end. Bear victorious witness and await the Lord. Amen. Amen. We of the last days will indeed welcome the Lord's return. Amen. Amen. Thank you. The police are here. Don't move. Hands on Get your down. hands. What law does our faith break? Silence! Stop! Be still! Don't move! Hands on your head! We haven't broken any laws! Tied them up! Behave! What have we done? Get up! What about the rule of law? You got some nerve! Coming here to spread your gospel! See about that, huh? Still believe? The gospel! A foreign religion! Dare Pull believe? him! Get out! You still believe? You still believe? Talk! Where'd you get the Bible? Stop hitting him! Why are you doing this? Yeah! We haven't broken any laws! You all behave! Damn it! That's wrong! Why are you beating him? Why? Because you're believers! That's what I do with believers! What about the law? Don't cause trouble! What are you looking at? That's what we do with you believers! You better behave! Want to believe? How dare you believe? The foreign religion! Foreign religion! You still believe? Talk. You still believe? Dare you! You've really got some gall. I'll sort you out today. I'll sort you out today. How dare you believe? How dare you believe? You're going to kill him. Stop. What about the law? Stop. Why are you doing this? It's illegal. Our faith is in a crime. How can you do this? Everybody behave. Why are you doing this? Where's your humanity? You want to go to prison, huh? You want to go to prison? What law is our faith to prison? Now be good. Get in there. Move. I want to go home. Home? Just wait. Your mom went to borrow money. If she doesn't come back with 200 yuan, you'll have to stay here.
Lord Jesus, please have mercy on me and be with me. In 1988, when I was 13 years old, I was detained in a raid on a fellowship gathering in the Xiaowei village. I endured one day and two nights in a dark little room filled with fear. Back then, people were always getting arrested, paraded in the streets, and sentenced to hard labor for gathering together and sharing the gospel. I didn't understand. We wanted to be good people and take the right path. So why was the government persecuting us? Why did the Communist Party hate us so much for our beliefs? Those were the questions in my young and tender heart. There's still a way to go. We're nearly there. She can't wait. This is Chenzi's first big trip. She's definitely been homesick. Of course. It's been almost two months. Yes. Yeah, time flies. Do you think this counts as a triumphant return? Definitely. definitely. Of course. Yeah. Right. Yes, that's right. We've learned so much. Everyone's going to be overjoyed to hear this news. For sure. For a gathering. What have you gotten there? You'll know soon enough. You certainly look pleased. Mom, I'm back. Mom. You must be frozen. No. How about the Northeast? It was freezing. Tenshi, it's great to see you. I should wait. <laughs> You've learned a lot from all those sermons, right? I've brought some good news back for everyone. Good news? Good news. What, what is, is it? it? Come what on, you... over here. Come on, come on. Bring us. Oh, that girl. You're so excited. What is it? Yeah, tell us. What? Look! The Holy Spirit has spoken. Here, let's read it. Everyone have a seat. Praise has come to Zion, and God's dwelling place has appeared. The glorious holy name extolled by all peoples spreads. Ah, Almighty God, Head of the Universe, Christ of the Last Days, the bright sun risen over Mount Zion, which towers in majesty and grandeur over all the universe. Amen. The, the triumphant King sits upon his glorious throne. He has accomplished redemption and led all his people to appear in glory. He holds the universe in his hands, and with his divine wisdom and might, he has built and made firm Zion. With his majesty, he judges the sinful world. He has passed judgment on all nations and all peoples, the earth and the seas and all the living things in them, as well as those who are drunk on the wine of promiscuity. God shall surely judge them, and he shall surely be angry with them. In 1991, we heard the Holy Spirit's words in a house church. Everyone was overjoyed and couldn't wait to share the news. A chapter of the Holy Spirit's words came out every day or so in a steady stream. God's words revealed many truths about faith in Him and mysteries of the Bible. 
and gave us the path for practicing the truth and entering into life. Reading God's words every day felt so nourishing. We were all constantly immersed in a state of joy. However, six months later, the Communist Party's persecution found us once more. My parents and my brother were all arrested. Where did these books come from? Where were they printed? Huh? No one's talking, huh? What about you? I don't know. Ah! You organize the gatherings, right? Tell me where those books came from. I don't know. The police took our tape recorder as collateral. They told me to go borrow money for the fine. What lowlifes. Where can we borrow that much money? You can leave now. We've got to keep arresting and finding those believers. We still need to look into the issue of these books. Yes, sir. some egg soup.
Gentsy, your things are packed. The police have been investigating the source of the books. Stay at Shinyu's place for the next few days. Then come back when this is blown over. Be careful on your way there. What on earth? What are you doing? Mom! Behave! Mom! What is this? Don't move! Stay still! Where'd you get these books? Where were they printed? Tell us! Tell us! Captain. 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 Chen Shi, you've got some guts for someone so young. You had some nerve sending out these Christian books. Did you know that our government has been cracking down hard on house churches? You people dare print religious materials in secret and distribute them? Do you know what kind of crime that is? You're disseminating cult literature and cult propaganda, trying to overthrow our national government. You could get 10 to 20 years for that alone. Tell us what you know. Where did these books come from? Confess! If you don't confess, you'll be in even more trouble. My faith is not a crime. I have nothing to confess. You're a hard nut to crack. You really drank the Kool-Aid, huh? Talk! Talk! You're just 17. We'd hate to see you give in hard labor. As long as you tell us everything you know, we'll send you right back home. How about it? As believers, we try to be good people on the right path, and we read God's words. Why won't the government just let us be? Why do you persecute us? You silly little girl. What do you know? In China, anything the Communist Party opposes is illegal. Got it? You won't believe in the party, but insist on believing in your God. Spreading your gospel everywhere. More people believe in God, and fewer follow the party. We have to stop you. Wipe you all out. That's the party's policy. It's law. Clear on that. Fess up! You'll be sorry if you don't! You, you, come with me. Move it! Come on! Get in there! Hurry up! Shenshi! Shenshi! Get back here! If you still don't want to talk, 
We'll get your dad to talk. Hmm? Dad! You stay here! This has nothing to do with my dad. Why are you beating him? Huh, nothing to do with him. Tell us! Where'd your daughter get those books? Where were they printed? Damn it! Your dad! Stop hitting him! Dad! 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 Can you take it? <laughs> you shit! Uh! Here, stop crying. Don't cry. The Communist Party is awful. This little girl just believes in God. She's done nothing wrong. But they beat her dad right in front of her. How could they do that? It's so cruel. It's okay. Don't cry. It's okay. We know everything already. Look. Someone already confessed and got to go home. Sort of pointless to be digging your heels in, isn't it? Once you've confessed everything, I'll call for a car to take you and your dad home. I give you my word. Whether your dad gets out or not depends on your cooperation. I'll ask you questions, and you just nod or shake your head. Did you go to Wanya village for a gathering? Did you go to the northeast to listen to sermons? Who was preaching? Where were those books printed? Huh? I didn't know them. I don't know where the books are printed.
classmate. Don't be silly. Isn't that Li Zhang Dao's daughter? Such a good kid. Why is she there? The party's arresting all the believers, even little girls. She's just a teenager. What does she know? What could she really believe in at her age? Doesn't she have anything better to do than that? That's what she gets. God, please bind Satan. Seal its mouth. Suspect Wu Deshun is under criminal detention according to the law. Li Chenxi is under criminal detention for breaking the law by illegally distributing cult literature and seriously disrupting social order. Wang Yukai has been involved in repeated thefts of personal property leading to serious repercussions. Write a letter of repentance. What's your problem? Write! Won't do it, huh? You'll get at least three years of hard labor. And three more if you still believe after that. And three more if you keep believing. You are going to rot in prison. Write, or you'll see what's coming to you. Yes? Come on. Betting from your parents. Hey, your family sent you betting? What's wrong? It's so hot, but they sent me a big duvet. I must be going to a labor camp. Hey, don't overthink it. See if there's something in here. Go on, what are you looking at? Come here, hmm? Hey, see what it is. Here, there's more. Do not be discouraged. Do not be weak. And I will make things clear for you. The road to the kingdom is not so smooth. Nothing is that simple. 
You want blessings to come to you easily, do you not? Today, everyone will have bitter trials to face. Without these trials, your love for me would not grow, and you would not truly love me. Even if these trials be minor, everyone must pass through them. It's just that the difficulty of the trials will vary from one person to another. Those who share in my bitterness will certainly share in my sweetness. That is my promise and my blessing to you. Just eat, drink, and enjoy my words. When the dark passes, light gathers. It is darkest before dawn. After this time, the sky gradually brightens. And then the sun rises. Do not be afraid or timid. I believe in the true God, and I will never betray Him. You talk pretty tough for a little girl. Let's see how you like the labor camp! Can she? Chen Wei, where's Dad? He already got out. Our aunt used her connections and paid to get you and Dad out. Otherwise, you'd have to do hard labor. Let's go home. Being arrested and persecuted? showed me how much the satanic regime hates believers and the truth in God's words. Only God has the truest love for people. And God is our only rock in hard times. Starting in 1995, I went through Henan, Hebei, and Shanxi sharing the kingdom gospel alongside brothers and sisters. Thanks to the Lord. This is the Holy Spirit. Many who read Almighty God's words recognize this is God's voice, and He is the Lord Jesus returned. One by one, they accepted Almighty God's work of the last days. We can only be saved and enter the kingdom of heaven by accepting Almighty God's work for the last days. Get out of here! No, get out! Get out of here! Please. Please. We will not accept your gospel. We believe in the Lord, in the Bible. The Communist Party started a nationwide operation in 1996 to counter so-called illegal activities. Large-scale arrests were carried out against house churches especially the Church of Almighty God. Where's your daughter? That year, the police went to my home to arrest me. So I didn't dare go back home again. I felt timid and afraid in the face of the Communist Party's oppression and arrests. We prayed and leaned on God and kept sharing the gospel and doing our duty, spurred on by God's words. Li Zhang Dao home. Li Zhang Dao? Hello, Li Zhang Dao. Go to the county hospital. For what? To identify a body. A body? Body? What body? 
What happened? What body? What's going on? Your daughter is dead. Mom! Oh, Mom! In 1998, I heard my mom's mental health had seriously declined. She was never the same again. I really wanted to go home and see her, but I couldn't for fear of being arrested. I found myself near to home in 2004, so I risked a visit. Dad. Mom. Chen Shi. Mom. It's me. Chen Shi. Mom. <coughs> You're back. Yes. Chen Shi's back. Dad. Chen Shi's back. She's back. It's wonderful that you're here. No one saw you come. No. Dad, how's your health? Just fine. Don't worry. Chen Shi. Chen Hui. You're back. I thought. Mom, what are you looking for? Sweetheart, have some candy. Mom, I'll get it myself. Come on, have some. Have some candy. Mom. Have some. Mom. Go ahead. I'll go fry an egg. It's your favorite. Mom, Mom, there's no need. It's late. We shouldn't wake the neighbors. Shh. I'll be quiet. I'll be quiet. Mom, there's no I'll need. I'll be quiet. Mom. It's okay. Just let her go. Chen Chi loves fried eggs. My darling loves fried eggs. Dad, what's wrong with Mom? The Communist parties kept a close eye on us ever since you left. Police and village cadres come often, demanding to know where you are. Your mom was afraid you'd be arrested again, and that they would take me, and I'd be beaten to death like Brother Zhang. She was afraid all the time and would keep the main gate locked, terrified that the police would burst through. Then an officer came and told us to go identify a body at the morgue. 
He said you died. It was such a blow for her. She ended up like this. Our family's faith has been such a wonderful thing. I never imagined. All right. Let's talk about something else. Seeing you doing well is enough for me. Chen Shi, will you stay for a few days? The police were just here asking about you. I came by to see everyone. I'll go before daybreak. Dad. I bought you and Mom some clothing. There's no need for that. Try it. See if it fits. Sweetie, don't go. All right. I won't. Chen Shi isn't leaving. to go. Hmm. We're so busy with the church's gospel work, and so many people don't know God has returned. I can't put my duty to spread the gospel aside for our personal struggles. That would be disloyal to God. Hmm. Be careful out there. Pray and lean on God. Be sure to be safe. The police are still looking for you. You should go. Don't worry. I'll take care of things at home. God, you know my weakness. Please enlighten and guide me. Give me faith and strength so I can stand firm.
In the past, people would all come before God to make their resolutions and they would say, even if no one else loves God, I must love Him. But now, refinement comes upon you. And since this does not align with your notions, you lose faith in God. Is this genuine love? You have read many times about the deeds of Job. Have you forgotten about them? True love can only take shape from within faith. You develop real love for God through the refinements you undergo. And through faith, you can be mindful of God's will in your real experiences. And it is also through faith that you forsake your own flesh and pursue life. This is what people should do. If you do this, then you will be able to see God's actions. But if you lack faith, then you will be unable to see God's actions or experience His work. The utmost faith and love are required from us in this stage of work. We may stumble from the slightest carelessness, for this stage of work is different from all the previous ones. What God is perfecting is mankind's faith, which is both invisible and intangible. What God does is convert words to faith, to love, and to life. People must reach a point where they have endured hundreds of refinements and possess faith greater than Job's. They must endure incredible suffering and all manner of torture without ever leaving God. When they are obedient unto death and have great faith in God, then this stage of God's work is complete. Amen. Thank God. God's words are always here to sustain and help us. His words brighten our hearts and give us strength. Yes, yes. God's words are wonderful. They are. I assumed the name Fang Jie in 2009, and I traveled through Sichuan, Anhui, and Shandong doing work for the church. That year, the Communist Party launched another national operation against the Church of Almighty God. The cops are coming! Don't move! Hurry up! Hurry, stop Please. there! Stop! Stop! What are you doing? Don't move! Freeze! 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 News of arrests of our brothers and sisters Please, kept move. coming from all Please, over. Brother Xiao Li and Sister Yu Ling, high-level leaders, were also caught. I'd never seen so many arrests in all my years as a believer. A dark, ominous feeling pressed down on all of China. It seemed no place was safe. The atmosphere of terror was suffocating. That August, they started large-scale arrests in Linyi, Shandong, where I was spreading the gospel. The Communist Party would dispatch large forces to seal off streets and apprehend Christians. Get up! Don't breathe! You have to go. Sister Chi and the others were arrested. Hurry up! Hurry up or you won't get out of the city! It all happened so fast, I didn't know where to go. There were arrests in Shandong and Jiangsu. 
Henan was a focus for Communist Party sweeps. I heard things were tense in Yunnan, Guizhou, and Sichuan as well. I thought of the only place I could go. Routine check. Show your ID. You. You. ID. You. ID. ID. God, please guide me. Where should I go now? Feng Ji? Sister Li. Come in. Brother Yang. Sister Fang. This is Sister Fang. She just fled to Fuyang and needs to stay here for a few days. All right. Have a seat. Here, sit down. Just relax and stay here for a bit. Learning a song? Sister Fang, could you take this to Sister Liu today and ask her to send it to Shuzhou ASAP? Mm -hmm. Sure. Have you learned it yet? Just about. Let's sing it together. All right. A few days ago, I heard from brothers and sisters in Henan that Brother Xiao Li was given 15 years. 15 years? And four others were given 10 years or more. What law does our faith break? Such harsh sentences. What about Sister Yulin? What did she get? You haven't heard? Sister Yu Ling was beaten to death by the police. Beaten to death? Five days after her arrest, she was tortured to death. Her husband saw bruises all over her body, but the police wouldn't admit it. They insisted she'd died suddenly of a heart attack. 
and that those bruises had appeared after she died. Why hasn't mom gotten back from sending that letter? Mom, Sister Feng. Someone was following me, just now. Did you lose them? Mm-hmm, I did. It's not safe here anymore. We have to move right away. We can hide at my sister's old place for now. All right. Sure. Hurry, let's get our stuff together. Take a break. <sighs> We've moved so many times this year. There's a lesson in it. Followers of God have to endure suffering. I'm constantly on edge. My heart skips a beat whenever I hear something outside. I'm afraid the police are going to burst in. The police are chasing me in my dreams. Na 满山的牛羊彼得能跟随耶稣基督更是因着他的心
神，以重返肉身，作工在人中间。The CCP started another round of mass arrests against the Church of Almighty God in 2012. Days before it launched, I went to Shuzhou to spread the gospel. I was just as cautious as always. But I didn't know that danger was already creeping towards me. Hello? Don't move! Come on! Get in! What are you doing? <laughs> you again. Are you Feng Ji? Are you a church leader? You think we don't know anything? We confiscated all those books you printed. You are the one in charge. Get up! Up! Now! Tell us, where's the church's money? Huh? Who's your leader? Will you talk? Huh? Will you talk? Will you talk? Will you talk? Will you talk? Huh? Will you talk? Will you talk? Will you talk? Will you talk? Then tell me first, what's your name? What's your full name? Why would you ask me that? You're interrogating me. Don't I have the right to know your name? Damn it. Get up. Shit, she's tough. Up! Squat! A number of officers tried, but they got nothing out of me. They transferred me to Nanjing for more questioning. Are you Fang Ji? Are you a church leader? Tell me. You think you can hold out on us and not get a prison sentence? Don't press your luck. The Central Committee has ordered us to make a clean sweep and totally eliminate the Church of Almighty God. Being so loyal to your faith will not only get you prison, it could cost you your life. Is it worth it? Think about it. In China, following the party is the only way to survive. Believing in God is simply not an option. After my arrest, the police wouldn't let me close my eyes or eat a bite of food. Uh, you feeling sleepy? No I was totally exhausted after three days and nights of torture. It felt like there was a heavy weight pressing on my chest, and
and I was struggling to breathe. I'll give you 30 more minutes. If you don't talk, the next round won't be this nice. It's 2.30 now. You have until three. In ten minutes. Have you thought it over? Twenty minutes. Five minutes left. You'd better think about this. Don't say I didn't warn you. they're going to do to me. Please protect me so I can get through this and stand witness. Now is the time that I shall test you. Will you offer your loyalty to me? Can you loyally follow me to the end of the road? Be not afraid. With my support, who could ever block this road? How about it? Have you made up your mind? I haven't done anything illegal. I have nothing to confess. Damn it! You're a piece of work! Do you have a family history of disease? She has a serious heart condition. We can't take her. It's fine. She'll just be here a week. She won't die. Get in. Strip for a search. Take your clothes off. Hurry up. Off. Come on. Take it all off. Do it!
all of it. Did you hear? Do I have to help you? Now! Arms out. Legs apart. Turn around. Turn around! Legs apart. Arms out. Out! Turn! Put them out. Turn around. Legs apart. Higher. Get in there. Go on. Take good care of her. <laughs> what did you do? How'd you end up here? Believing in God. <laughs> Believing in God? Where is he anyway? Yeah. Where is he? Take your clothes off. Why? For a search. He just did that. We need to do another one. That's the rule. Take it off. Come on. What's the holdup? Hurry up. Come on. Stop dragging your feet. Would you hurry it up? Take everything off. You got yourself here. Don't pretend to be so innocent. Come on. Spread your legs and do a wide squat. Down. I'm on my period. Don't waste your breath. Do it! Squat. Now! Get up. Squat. <laughs> up. Squat. Up. Squat. Up. Squat. The Communist Party is truly evil. They're lower than beasts and deserve damnation. Get up. 
It's your shift, come on. <sighs> Starting my first day in the detention house, I had to take a two and a half hour shift every night of walking back and forth without stopping, even when my heart acted up. Hey, away from the wall. Are you asking for trouble? Otherwise, Come on, move it. I'd be punished with a five hour shift the next day. I learned what it's like to have every day feel like a whole year. Sunjing, hurry it up! You're taking ages to brush your teeth. Stop dragging your feet. Food's coming soon. Hurry up there. Li Chunji, come here. Go clean the bathroom. What kind of scrubbing is that? Get your arm in there. Get it clean. Down. Farther down. You can eat. Toilet, please. Me too, please. Anyone else need to go? I do. Go ahead. How are you supposed to get down? Time's up. Go next time. Get back up there. What are you looking at? Don't you get it? She said go back. Stop. Your slippers. Straighten them. There wasn't any freedom or dignity there. There were rules for sitting, Walking, getting off the platform. Bathroom, please. Hold it. Even using the bathroom, the most basic of human rights, was strictly limited. Sun Ching Peter Pants! Ew, that's embarrassing. Sun Ching, what the hell is wrong with you? Clean it up, fast! Who told you to piss on the platform? Clean it up. Are you stupid? There's something wrong with you. Stop your crying. Move it. Some prisoners ended up losing their minds, unable to withstand 
the long-term torture and abuse. Are you really crazy or just pretending? You're faking it, right? Is it real? <laughs> Here you go. Eat. Have some more. The Communist Party prison was hell on earth. <laughs> Lee Chen Shi! She's using the bathroom. <laughs> You're called for questioning. Li Chen Chi, we know everything about your family. Are you Fang Jie? You won't say anything because you're afraid of betraying your god, of being a Judas, right? <laughs> We've already told your church friends that you told us everything. They won't want you back when you get out. You're screwed either way. Yours is a special case. We can keep you locked up indefinitely, however long we want. Go think it over. My first three months in the detention house, the police questioned me regularly. Sometimes from morning until night. Speak now! I was under incredible stress from non-stop Tell threats us. and exploitation. What were you doing in Chushu? Sometimes I'd feel panic and tightness in my chest and a pain in my heart. You On top of questioning, sit up straight. they made me watch videos glorifying the Communist Party every day and talk about what I'd learned. That was also a Lee kind Chen of torture Chi. for me. Share what you've gained from watching the 18th National Congress. I have nothing to say. You have to! I just hope that the Communist Party respects the law, allows freedom of belief, and stops persecuting Christians. You really have a mouth on you. Make a note of that. Next. Once winter started, each day was colder than hurry, the last, and my prison days became even harder. Gagging. Hurry up. It's freezing. <laughs> the party is so damn evil. Washing with freezing water in the dead of winter will kill us. <sighs> They're experts at torturing people. The party's been awful from the very start. All its words are sweet, all its deeds are evil. <laughs> you, hurry up. Get out of here when you're done. Don't waste time. humans. My health continued to deteriorate in such a terrible environment. My rheumatism and heart condition grew worse. <laughs> I was weak and in pain and always wanted to lie down. But when it did come time to sleep, I was afraid. Because that was like being punished too. It was so crowded, I couldn't even move. Get up. It's your shift. Hurry up. The cold the sleep deprivation, 
and the pain made every step torture. It was as if time stopped. Every single second was a struggle. I constantly prayed, sang hymns in praise of God, and asked him to be with me. What's wrong? Are you okay? Hey, wake up. Li Chen Shi's heart is acting up again. Li Chen Shi's heart is acting up again. Should I report it to the guard? The guard won't do anything. Just do your shift. here. God, my life is in your hands. Even if I don't make it, I still give thanks to you and praise you. If I am called to give my life standing witness for you, I'll have no regrets. It's all been worth it. Leech and she. I've never seen anyone as stubborn as you. It's been more than three months, and you haven't given us anything. You've practically got me on my knees. You could... You could even make something up. So we can tell our superiors we got something. You... I don't understand. The government has cracked down so hard on believers in Almighty God. Why are your people so driven? You give up everything, determined to believe in God. You go on the run. You can't go home. No one pays you for this. What's it all for? You're atheists who don't believe there's a god. What would you know about faith? You just care about money, fame, and status. But do those things really bring you peace? I think people with those things suffer more. You just obsess over promotions, riches, fixing others. There's no telling when you'll be imprisoned, lose your life, or lose your standing. We all get what we deserve in the end. This is a dark and evil world. The Lord Jesus said, Repent, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Disasters are growing fiercer. Anyone without faith, without repentance, will be punished, swept away in the disasters, and will die. Almighty God expresses the truth to cleanse mankind, to save us from the disasters so we can enter his kingdom. 
This is a wonderful thing. We share the gospel and give testimony so more people will accept God's work of the last days, gain his salvation, and be part of the kingdom of heaven. What's wrong with that? Why are you always persecuting us? Aren't you supposed to serve the people? Why can't you leave people of faith be? Li Tenshi! That's enough out of you. You dare preach to us? You're an intractable, godized element. Li Tenshi, your parents are so old. And they took care of you all those years. You're not at home taking care of them. Instead, you're running around for your gospel. Aren't you letting them down? Have you realized that you might never see them again if you're sentenced to 10 or 20 years? You really want them to grow old alone? Isn't that selfish of you? Just tell us about your church and we'll let you go home. We'll help you find a job so you can take good care of your parents. What do you think? When I was 13, I was arrested for attending a gathering. The police locked me in a small dark room for two nights and a day. I don't know how I would have gotten through that without the Lord by my side. When I was 17, my whole family was arrested for believing in God. The police interrogated and tortured them nonstop. And my dad was nearly blinded in one eye from being beaten. They even beat him right in front of me, trying to get me to tell them about the church. I was paraded through the streets, mocked and humiliated by countless people. If it weren't for the strength God gave me, how could I have withstood such humiliation and pain as a young teenage girl? My dad's health deteriorated after being beaten like that. And things got harder at home. We struggled to make a living. The police kept monitoring and trying to arrest me, forcing me to go on the run. My home family lived in fear. And our lives were destroyed. When I was 23, the local police lied, telling my family that I died. And asked them to identify my body at the morgue. My mom couldn't take it and had a mental breakdown. Since then, she's been a completely different person. Confused one moment, alert the next.
all household responsibilities have fallen on my brother's shoulders. As their daughter, all that I'm able to do for them, aside from pray, is worry. I can't do a thing for them. The local government and police never took their eyes off our house, even on the holidays. All just to get to me. Home? I lost that ages ago. I haven't been able to go back for years. If it weren't for God giving me guidance, protection, and faith, if it weren't for the brothers and sisters of God's house, I would have been... For me, going home... is an impossibility. I long to see my parents in my dreams. That would be enough for me. We didn't do any of these things. That was all your local police. We had nothing to do with that. We really feel for what you've suffered. But this is the party policy. Our hands are tied. Do you want redress like for the Cultural Revolution. I know that believers in Almighty God are all good, kind people. And we don't have anything against you personally. If you have to hate something, hate the party. Over four months passed, since the police didn't find any conclusive evidence, and I had a serious heart condition. They released me on bail pending trial, and had the local public security and judicial authorities in my hometown monitor me. Li Chen Shi, call me the moment you arrive. Did you hear me? Your case is still open. Soon as we confirm your role and actions in the church, we'll bring you back in. Run to the ends of the earth, and we'll still get you. Get going. Come on. Li Jianxi, don't think it's all over because you're on bail. You are a primary target for monitoring in our city. 
You need to report to the police station on time every month. You're absolutely forbidden to practice your faith, attend gatherings, or share the gospel. You can't have contact with believers or leave the area. I don't have any freedom at all. You want freedom? We have to keep a close eye on you God-eyed elements. I'll be coming by to check up on you. If we find out that you're practicing your faith or sharing the gospel on the sly, you'll get at least eight years. Got it? Take her photo. What's that for? To locate her wherever she goes. Help the government and keep an eye on her. Okay. Report her right away if she keeps on with that god stuff. All right. Watch her. Going out? Where are you headed? Going out again? Almighty God, you know what I'm facing. I can't go to gatherings or share the gospel. God, please show me a way out. Christians in the Bayoun district are interested in the true way and want to read Almighty God's words. We should send a couple of people over. I heard some brothers and sisters went to share the gospel a few days ago, but a pastor reported them to the police. We have to tread carefully and send people who know what they're doing. You're right. Brother Wang and Sister Zhou have been arrested. Hurry! When I was sharing the gospel in Guangdong in 2013, there was another round of Communist Party arrest operations. The evening of September 25th alone, nearly 200 church members were taken. In 2014, the Communist Party launched a national campaign against the Church of Almighty God, the Hundred Days Battle. Huge numbers of public security officers, armed police, and regular officers were dispatched to arrest Christians. So many brothers and sisters were taken. Some were sentenced. Some were beaten to death. And some had their organs removed. In China, a sense of fear permeates everything. The shadow of the Communist Party's reign of terror over Christians looms over all of China. Protect me, so I can be strong and brave through this nightmare, and follow you until the very end.
Thank you.